Hello to all, it's me again. Yes, that's right, Pete. I'm back here for another video. Uh, I believe it's video number four on this occasion. And we're going to be looking at the A major chord, and I want to cover the G major as well for you today. Okay, so uh, let's get straight to it. We're going to be looking at our finger positions. Now, predominantly here, we're going to be in position two for all of our fingers for the A major. Okay, so um, what we're going to have, and um, you might well note that my finger position for A major is a little bit different to some of the textbooks. This is what works for me, and I teach my students the same shape. So hope you get on with it okay. Um, once again, we're going to ignore the bottom E, okay? And we are going to start with the open A string, okay? So that's our first note in the chord. Then we're on the D string, okay, which is string number four. And we are putting the second finger on the D string in the second position. Okay, which is fret two, yeah. Then the index finger is still in position two or fret two, and we're going to be on the G string. Okay, then we have the third finger in position two, and that is going to be on the B string, and then we let the top E string ring out open. Okay. So here is your A major sound. Yeah, sounds pretty good. I uh, hope you get on with the shape. Once again, as I said to you before, try and keep your fingers um, as near to the edge of the fret as you can. Don't put undue pressure on to hold the uh, strings down to get your sound. And check for each string to sound nice and crisp and clear. Okay. There you are, there's your A major. Good. So let's have a look at G major next. Okay. There are three notes that we're going to be fretting with our fingers in this chord. Um, it's a little bit tricky for some beginners, this one, a little bit of a funny shape. Um, but nevertheless, let's have a look at it. So um, we've got this kind of triangular shape, uh, I suppose, if you view it a bit like that. We're going to start with the second. Oops, sorry for the mess up, my mistake. Have a look at video 5 and we'll capture G major properly there for you. Thanks for watching. See you soon.